Thanks be to God, who always leads us as captives in Christ's triumphal procession and uses us to spread the aroma of the knowledge of him everywhere. Paul lived in the Roman Empire, and everyone knew that the Roman army was the most powerful army on earth. And often when they would come back from battle victorious, they would have a parade right through the middle of the city, and the multitudes, the people, the population would line up to watch the parade. And in the parade, the Roman soldiers would march, but also they would have their captives, their enemy that was defeated and in chains and in bondage, and they would march them through the city so everyone could see. And they would also burn incense. Now, the incense were captured. They were spoils of war, because in that foreign country, one of the most important goods that they traded internationally was incense. So they would burn the incense in the parade, and the incense uh, spread the aroma and created an atmosphere of victory. Now this verse says that Christ leads us as captives. We are captives in Christ's triumphal procession, but we're captives in a good way. Uh, Jesus rescued us from Satan. He rescued us from death. And so we march in Christ's triumphal procession, a parade for everybody to see, and we are his captives. And he uses us to spread the aroma, that's the reference to the incense, of his knowledge, the knowledge of him everywhere. So we are captives in Christ's triumphal parade. Christ is victorious. We are more than conquerors. We are captives, but we're also a part of the victory, and we spread the aroma of the knowledge of Jesus. This is Pastor Mark Wright of Evers Road Christian Church, and this has been a victory verse in the Shield of Faith video series.